Hello and welcome back to another episode of uh Hongkai Star Rail. This is what what you will see right now is what I did last night. Why I'm not recording any voiceover, so I need to rush to do it last night because after I done with this part, it's gonna unlock the function that I need to have in order to continue the story. On one side, but by tall, blue and last night I didn't listen to any of the story, so we're gonna listen to this together. <laughs> Dragon Young. And his opponent, <laughs> the name. <laughs> none other than the unfeeling, incendiary, explosive might of Team Robomatic. All praise to Boss Farag. Okay. Given that no other fighter was willing to take on the strength of Team Robomatic, Cold Dragon Young will face off against these opponents alone. On learning his fate, <laughs> the brave young fighter had won. Oh, if you don't remember, Sampo bring Dan Heng here, and this is what so, co happening right now. Of the Man, I love Sampo. <laughs> fighting King challenge begin. Quick, let's help him. Oh, brothers and sisters, an unexpected turn of events. Two members of the audience have charged into the octagon. It looks like they want to yeah. team up with Cold Dragon. I did it Young. last night, and <laughs> I just said the fight so is really awake. easy. <laughs> yeah, the first thing we did was go look for you, and now that we found you, we're trying to make sure you don't get your butt kicked. You're welcome, brothers and sisters. You can feel their passion. The magnetic pull of this electric sport is undeniable. But let me reiterate, these competitions are for professionals only. Okay. Whatever you do, kids, don't try this at home. And Cold Dragon Young is signaling that the contest will go ahead. He's just itching to get into it. And so are we. It's the Iron Fist of Cold Dragon Young and friends versus the <laughs> and friends of team <laughs> robomatic i can take them on my own you know oh, we need to work on your emotional intelligence so let's uh what did i kick that nice let's throw them all right maybe hello pass me i used to leave Hello! Why are you two you what took you so long past me? Okay, he's here. Yeah, that's all them all. Let's go. <laughs> Fighting is meaningless. Alright. No manners, huh? Yeah, I remember that. <laughs> The robot explode by themselves. Let's make it quick. Bye bye. And I also dish my servant oh, for the four star that I low last time. The the Cassis girl from Overworld. I don't remember her me. name, <laughs> but she do ice damage. Oh, forget it. I think so our she gonna take much pace for now until hey, we look, get any healer. Hello, Sampo. <laughs> Let's okay, get we got him. Question to demand. Explanation on demand. Pella. Yeah, yeah, the one that have last year name. Pella scabbard something. Let's That's really body. long. A chest. Let's go.
and they say find samples so I look around for everything that might have sample hiding inside but hey, actually no hey it's you I was just thinking to myself am I getting robbed who are these people following me so you know you start to walk a little faster and anywho if I just turned around, I could have thrown open my arms and said a big hi to my old friends. <laughs> Save okay. it. You saw us in there and got scared, so you pulled a runner. Me? Scared? Oh, <laughs> my friends, what do I have to fear? <laughs> Surely I haven't done anything to offend you. Yeah? Maybe. Yeah, the girl from Superman. God, that is My the one I fellow, please take the place again. in for you Mars. You scared the daylights out of me. Take Mars out and take Pella in. Wait a minute, we're not done here. You dragged <laughs> us to the underground. So what's the big idea? I had no choice but to take you guys down here. It was too dangerous for us on the surface. We're wanted criminals. Sure, the underworld has its drawbacks, but at least the guards would never follow us. We're safe here. Okay. Be that as it may, did you really have to poison us? He poisoned us? Maybe you've forgotten, but we were in a tight spot, my friend. There was no time to think. I had to use whatever I could. Aww. Hmm. So it wasn't to cover anything up? A secret that you didn't want anyone, including us, to find out? Like how you travel between <sighs> overworld and underworld? Don Hung, what secret? Well, I'm not certain yet. But there's more to our friend here than meets the eye. You win! I'll help you to the best of my ability, free of charge, I might add. Thank but you! Please, don't go spreading rumors about me. <sighs> All right, to prove my sincerity, I'll introduce you to Wildfire. If you're looking for something down here, they're the ones to ask. Okay, okay. So I'm in hurry last night, so let's lead the Have way. Have a little faith. It's like I said, Sampo never lets friends who've helped him come to harm. <laughs> Ready? So what does Wildfire do all day? By everything. They keep the peace, uphold justice, fight for resources, distribute goods. Mm -hmm. The sliver of trust they have for me has to do with the last one. <laughs> okay, so you are the smuggler for a while, while. All right, all right, we get everything we, ha we can. And we have to go over there, so let's go. Huh, where's Joshua? Who? What are those shiny rocks? Ah, this is Geomero, an exothermic ore. The underground and the surface are sealed off from one another, right? Well, only the Geomero transport line is still running. The underground sends ore to the surface, and the surface sends goods to the underground. At least in theory. Mm -hmm. Most undergrounders are miners, and this is what they mine for a living. You know, if we didn't have Geomero to burn, this world would have frozen to death long ago. Ah, that's right, really important. Person I was looking okay. For here. So, who are you looking for? Um, pass me, please move. Hello, are you there? I understand. No, you don't understand. This is the recording that I'm showing you guys right now, not me playing live. <laughs> it's not like this video is live either. It's a recording, and I'm gonna upload on YouTube. So, mm, whatever, right? <laughs> Go there next. Hello, where are you going? That is where we come from. 
Turn around, yeah, like that. Oh, old Oleg isn't here either? Where is everyone? <laughs> <sighs> so you're leading us on another wild goose chase? <laughs> I wouldn't dare! Trust me, we're getting close. How <sighs> close? Huh? What's that huge structure in the distance? Oh, that's the furnace core. It's the pillar that connects the underworld and the overworld. People used to travel up and down that thing, but then... Then what? Hmm, exactly. It's a long story. In any case, practically nothing moves up or down anymore. Ah. Uh. Except you. <laughs> oh, come on, my dear fellow. I thought we weren't going to discuss this. I beg you, the fewer rumors there are about me, the better. Okay, okay. What do you say, Sample? Where are we going next? Where are we going next? Or the... Also, one thing. I really close to get my first five star from the Ganji Gacha. I'm excited to see who I get and hey, look, I'm gonna make that? that five star the center of my team. Unless the it opponent like needs other elements that that five star look, is weak again. My friends, don't but just usually, stand there. This drama fine, right? doesn't need any more bystanders. Oh, you know, it might be interesting to see you get in trouble. Hmm. <sighs> we should avoid attracting too much attention. We can't just leave her. Uh, I remember Kiri. What I did last night. Yeah, anyone have popcorn? We want Dama, uh, right? I was kidding. Then get your own Come opinion. on. <laughs> but I agree with Don Hung. We can't just leave her to the bullies. Really? Well said. The young lady is wise and righteous. Ah. Let's help her. All right, princess. Let's dispense with the pleasantries. I don't think we in time to help. Oh, so hello. You dare attack someone on our turf? The music. The music. Come on, it's cut Quick, too short. Spineless thugs. Miss Zila, phew. Sela? Okay, that's you how you pronounce that name, Sela. These vagrants have got some nerve looking for trouble in wildfire terror. Ah, shut it, Sampo. This is you written all over it. <laughs> wildfire has countless issues on its plate right now. We don't need a side order of Koski. I hear Silvermane Guard is paying the underworld a visit. Is that you? You kidnapped me and brought me to the underground. What is the meaning of this? <laughs> Listen to her. What is the meaning of this? She still thinks she's an overworld princess. Oh. Do you know what's become of us down here while you live the easy life? Did you even consider the fate of the underworlders? The Silvermane guards aren't living the easy life. We are constantly engaged with the enemy, defending Bellabog from the scourge of attacking monsters and protecting all those above and below the surface. That what you believe. <laughs> Do you even hear yourself? You protect the underground, redeploying every guard to the surface, sealing off the only passageway, protecting the so-called architects, more like it. The Madam Guardian has her reasons. <laughs> Enough talk. You're coming with me. Chief Oleg wants to see you, and he's got more than a few questions. Hmm. Perfect, Miss Hila. We were just on our way to pay <laughs> Chief Oleg a visit ourselves. Room for a few more? Fully booked. <laughs> Who are they? Um, Karas. What good is your name by itself? Come on, I introduce well, myself. Like this. The chief's in the market for specific talent. An urgent request, so I'm taking them to see him. We're looking for a Stellaron. 
It's the source of all the disasters here. If we find it, we can... <laughs> I would recommend you not recite your story to everyone you meet. Miss Hila won't understand it anyway, so let's save it for the chief, huh? Are you saying that Sela is right. dumb? I don't understand it. Okay. And I don't plan okay. on passing the message on either. <laughs> I wanna cut. I Wildfires will not encounter you. trouble okay. at the Great Mine. <laughs> the chief's busy. If you really want to find him, come look for me at the mine entrance. I'm leaving. Okay. And now this is the part that our progress is locked by the tail brace level and it's unlocked daily training for me to use in order to gain that level so we're gonna stop that here yeah i'm gonna stop it here and go over here for if you can look at it i'll tell Blessed level is already 14, so I'm gonna go and continue our story, shall we? So last time it's 7. 7. So we're gonna go mission. This one. Oh, yeah, we press this. This. Border city, right? Border city, this one, and go here. Teleport. I really love how fast it is that the flat tower in this game actually are. Because some game fast tower is not fast at all, it's so slow, it took like a minute and a half to load. <laughs> but this one took like 10 seconds. That's acceptable, right? Of course, uh, what is Wildfowl doing in the mall? I forgot to turn on our game audio. Okay. The underground used to have many mines. However, in recent years, some sort of corrosion called the Fragmentum started to spread. It's ruined a lot of mines. How did you know about Fragmentum then? The one we're heading into is relatively unaffected. A bunch of vagrants made it their home after their old turf was consumed by the Fragmentum. Actually, most of them are pretty honest folks. But with Aww. such a large group, it's inevitable that troublemakers will find their way in. They've been stealing stuff from the miners and picking fights. And that's not the worst of it. Hmm. Things are much more serious this time. For two days now, huge clashes have been breaking out between the miners and the vagrants. It isn't pretty. Oh, that doesn't Mines sound good. Mines are our lifelines in the underworld. We have to keep providing Geomero to the overworld in exchange for supplies. In order to quell the situation, Chief Oleg brought wildfire into the mine and left me in charge of security for the towns. But the situation in the mine is critical. I have to back him up. Uh-huh. Okay. <laughs> Can you go over it again? Understood. Oh. Let's go. As for you... The chief will decide your fate when we see him. Good. I've been wanting to come face to face with the leader of the underworld. <laughs> You're about to come face to face with reality. Damn. Sela, will you join my team? Oh no. Please join my team. Uh -huh. I'm begging. Isn't that the doctor lady? Who? What's Natasha doing here? Hello, Natasha. Nat, I didn't think you'd be here. Where's Oleg? Hey, Zila and Sampo's guests. So it looks like you've already met. Mm -hmm. I haven't seen Oleg. The miners said they saw him take a group further in. Uh, what are you doing here? I heard that the miners had been having violent clashes with local thugs with significant numbers of wounded. I hurried over here to see if I could help. Oh, you're so kind. You see these people? They're all miners and their family members. They want an explanation from the instigators. This area up ahead is a vagrant dwelling, but they've sealed off the entrance. 
I guess they're afraid that angry miners might try to take revenge. Mm. How could the situation here become such a mess? I heard that first mining team found a geomero vein with incredible deposits. <laughs> the initial estimate put it at the largest discovery in the last 30 years. Ooh. Are you serious? That's big news. How come I never heard about it? Well, they weren't in a hurry to make it known. <laughs> Most of the mines have been contaminated by the Fragmentum. Many people are out of work. They were afraid of being overwhelmed if they let the word out. Uh... But the vagrants here have keen eyes. They couldn't keep it hidden from them. Some local gangs wanted to profit from the situation, so they blackmailed the mining team for hush money. And that was the final straw. Uh... Uh, the body choice isn't good, but this one. As it happens, that's exactly the law we have down here. Ah, uh, okay. But the vagrants have their own custom. See it, share it. And that's how the clash started. Now both sides are dealing with heavy losses. So, are you guys here to help resolve the conflict? Well, if you let us... They're here because they need a favor from Chief Oleg. I'm escorting them. And seeing as you need that helping hand, it wouldn't be too much to ask you to lend one here first, right? Yeah. Of course we want to help. We care about other people too, you know. <laughs> Not in the rest, sorry. Sound like a fair trade off. <laughs> of course it is. Nobody gives without expecting something in return. Yep. <laughs> I believe we're dealing with kind-hearted people here, Zila. Really? As you've all seen, I'm the situation kind, down here is you know? some... strained. If you can, we would really appreciate you helping the people. Now, that that's a happy join my team. Will you join my team? Crack a little. Oh, equipment. Equipment, equipment. I see. Musketeer, HP, equip, attack, equip. Aha, uh -huh. what are the shoes and armor? Carven. Okay, what else? For some string item. Relic, relic, relic. <laughs> These are relic. Thank you. <laughs> so what's is a relic? A construct made from a data stream. Many believe they are linked to Ceron and the fragmentum phenomenon. What we refer to as relics are objects corroded by the fragmentum whose data is saved and been reconstructed. Okay, thank you. So what is Lilic? <laughs> you could consult her that she an expert in Lilic research. Is that all? <laughs> okay. Oh, that's so cute that we have a group chat with everyone. Uh, but let's go in. How do we go in? From here, maybe. Hello. Quiet. Oh, this is a shard for the... For this thing. What do you call? Talent? Maybe. Technique. Yeah, technique. The giant ore vein. Talent is the a passive discovered. ability. That must be where the clashes are centered. Come on. Let's get to higher ground and take a look. No, we have chests over here. That person up ahead, is he asleep? Let's head up and take a look. He might need help. Uh, he might be asleep. Yeah. Falling asleep in a place like this, impressive. Hey, wakey, wakey. You'll get mushrooms growing on your head. <laughs> Mushroom bread? I can't see it on the menu. Huh? 
Miss Sila! Have you got a death wish or something? How can you sleep here? Get back to safety and take shelter! Oh, you so nice, Sila. Take shelter? I remember now. These guys came out of nowhere and got into a fight with the mining team. At the time, I was exhausted. I'd hardly oh, you have a few feet when one of them caught me. <laughs> if it weren't for wildfire, they'd have stolen the clothes off my back. Nice, nice. You have what the... You have access. And then where did the fire, uh, fire go? Further in, I guess. Those thugs took control of the vein ages ago. And they're fully armed. We poor, defenseless, good folks were no match for them. It's only thanks to wildfire that the grapevine hasn't fallen into their hands completely. Ah. It seems like Chief Oleg must be up ahead. Hurry up and get back to safety. Look for Nat. And try not to get into another scrap along the way. Okay. Thank you for, um, getting me on my feet. If I get back soon enough, I'll have time for a, for a nap. Really? <sighs> yeah, um, good night. I maybe. recognize that woman. That's Elaine from First Mining Team. Quick, let's get up there and see if she's wounded. Yeah? Hello? Elaine! Are you okay? Are you hurt? Uh, Zila, thank goodness. I I'm fine. Just a couple of sprains. You've got good timing. Those vagrants were asking me about the robots, but I don't know anything. Robot? Oh, uh, don't you know? The intersection of the Great Mine has been seized by a band of robots. Neither huh? the mining team nor the vagrants can get anywhere near. The new challengers enter. About time. Even <laughs> only conflicts are so boring. Does anyone know where the robots come from? <sighs> At first, we thought that a collective fault had occurred in the excavation machines. But then we found out that those machines didn't even belong to the mining team. Mm. They came out of nowhere and pushed the vagrants and us back. Then they blocked off the only tunnels into the intersection. Maybe it formed the overworld? Maybe someone praying quick. <laughs> There's no way anyone in the mining team is behind this. Operating a single unit is tiring enough, but a whole group? <laughs> Impossible. Then there's only one possibility. Boss Svarog. Svarog? That name sounds familiar. <sighs> you remember the robots we defeated in the boxing gym? Ah. Oh, Boss Svarog's robots! What's his deal? Let's just say he's not to be trifled with. Let's go and find some other people. Elaine, can you make it back to safety? No problem. Zila and the rest of you, be careful. Robots aligned against humans? I've never heard of such a thing. Machines should obey humans unconditionally. Hmm. Is this elevator broken? Why isn't it r responding? Uh, this is broken. Why are you worried about this piece of junk? Do you really want to go down there and be a live target for the robots? But if we evacuate, then haven't we lost out? <sighs> you idiot, we'll just steal off the miners. Look, I saw with my own eyes. They managed to bag some Geomara. This is a perfect opportunity. You are dead meat. Oh, good idea. We sell her here. <laughs> Shameless. Still after the miners, are you? Time to teach you a lesson. Are you joining the Pfizer, lah? No, you did not. Come on. No the manners, truth of huh? life and death reveal the sanctuary is but a vision. Break. All right. <laughs> Commencing support. Ready for another? This is our chance. Easy. <laughs> Fleeing at the first sign of danger. That's all they're good for. Huh? What's this? Did those guys leave it behind? Hmm? Whoa, whoa! What the heck? Beep, beep, beep! Searching for potential user. Beep, beep, beep! Voice print detected. Looking up corresponding identity information. Oh my, it's an alien! <laughs> hey, it talks! And it knows that we aren't from this planet? 
It doesn't seem to be technology from here. Look, it even has an International Peace Corporation logo on it. Perhaps it's an antiquity left behind by some past interstellar traveler. Ah, the beep, logo. Beep, beep. Your mom's an antiquity. Uh. Beep, beep, beep. Whatever, whatever. So you aliens know about the Interastral Peace Corporation? That's great. Beep, beep, beep. Beep, beep, beep. I am Richard, the home use object finder. Model information. Version 0 0.6. You're not even Professional version 1. Model. So you are a beta Nickname? Version. Bindy. A home use object finder? Who knew the IPC made these kinds of products? Beep, beep, beep. My brainwave scanner module is damaged. Please send me to an interastral peace appliances retail store near you for free repair within the warranty <laughs> period of 232 years, 84 days. Beep, beep, beep. Alien, please take me to an interastral peace appliances retail store to conduct repairs. What? This spell is already broken. What should we do? Take it with us? Uh, let's take it. It may be some use. Beep, beep, beep. Yes, yes, yes. When you need to find something you can't see, just call upon Findy. That's me! So, what do you help us with? Can't use the lift. Okay. Hello! Mm, let's do this first. You're made to be broken! Yeah. Too late to repent. We have the upper hand. Ready for another? Bye bye. I think what here? Ah, this thing. Okay, let's play some puzzle. Look easy enough. Easy. Speed borrow. One moment. I need to explore a little bit. Hey. So let's go. Where do you want me to go, Lobot? Ah, you go over there anyway. Good, good, good. No interest in conflict. Scared yet? Who will it be? We have the upper hand. This is our chance. Ah, oh, not enough. <laughs> Ready for another? Easy. Now, the combat report continue. will be ready soon. Hey, what's that commotion? It sounds just... like there's a big argument happening. Ah, okay. Let's get closer Let's go and this take a way look. First. Nice, thank you. Thank you, Mr. Robot. Now, uh, uh, are we gonna fight again? Cowards and bullies. I don't remember you guys acting this tough around Svarog's minions. <laughs> Did your parents never teach you what a backbone was? <laughs> <laughs> we ain't stupid. Why would we risk our lives against the robots? And get off the high road. You can't just find a huge chunk of Geo Marrow and hog it all to yourselves. <laughs> This mine is our territory. The mining team is laboring here day in and day out. You guys don't even pretend like you're here to lend a hand. You're lazy. All you want is to profit off our sweat and tears. And you don't even try hiding it. <laughs> Disgraceful. <laughs> well, that's true though. They work hard to get those Tiomaru, and you just come and steal them. Where does disgrace come into it when we can't even fill our stomachs, huh? Come work! I know your game. 
You're just waiting for us to starve to death so there's more food for your mining team. It's a waste of time trying to reason with you. While you've been kicking up this fuss, the whole vein's been seized by robots. Now we're all in the same boat. <laughs> right, right. We can't rely on the vein anymore. But don't forget which side brought loaded guns to the party. Whoa, easy. What are you trying to pull off? I'm warning you, wildfire in the area. <laughs> Come on. Empty threat. <laughs> wildfire are stuck dealing with Sparag's minions. How are they gonna help you now? Unless you're planning on taking a bullet. Hand over the supplies and equipment. Um, you know, we are here. We're getting ready to attack. Those miners are unarmed. You shameless scoundrels. Uh. Let's hit them. I'm going to. We can't let these thugs get away with whatever they like. You saying that, but you didn't enjoy the combat. Ah. Yeah, and you did not join the combat. Do you know whose territory this is? Shut it. This isn't your territory. I'm in a hurry. I'll take you all in one go. No manners, huh? <laughs> Enemy targets detected. Ready for another? Let's make it quick. Are made to be broken. Yep. Bye bye. Oh, Zila. Thank goodness you came. We were nearly uh <laughs> nothing but a few knuckleheads. I'm just glad you're okay. Antonia, have you seen Chief Oleg? Oleg? He took a group into the intersection. Said it was to clear off the invading robots. Oh. They've been gone for a while now. <laughs> if Wildfire was around, those thugs wouldn't have dared. Seems like the core of this problem is Svarog's robots. We need to talk to him. The boss. He appeared suddenly after the guards were redeployed and became a major player in the underworld. Svarog claims to be a guardian of humanity. All the ownerless robots obey his commands. Huh. They've occupied the Furnace Core hub, and they're not letting anyone get close. Nobody knows why Svarog did any of this. He usually doesn't leave the Furnace Core and interfere unless some kind of disorder breaks out in the underworld. Wait, a guardian of humanity? Th that can command robots? I I've never heard of anything like... <laughs> Looks like your mighty architects weren't as all-knowing as you thought. Can you two say anything without quarreling? <laughs> this isn't the time! <laughs> Okay. Sounds like there's danger waiting for us in the intersection. Can we still get through? Well, I want to meet right. him. Right. There's unfinished business here. The chief is still down there. It's only a bunch of scrap metal. What are we afraid of? Oh, is Zila starting to appreciate our strength? Hmm? I'll be honest. You guys are hardworking. If everyone from Wildfire were as impressive as you on the battlefield, we wouldn't be so hard-pressed by Svarog. Antonia, can you take the mining team back through the entrance to meet up with Natasha? Yeah, sure thing. But uh, be careful. There are a lot of robots up ahead. Don't worry, robot is really easy to deal with. Oh, new one. What are these? Huh? Oh, nice. And I have a lot of these too. Actually, I will do that off stream. It's gonna take much, <laughs> a little bit of time to do that. But it's nice that we unlock that. Is this the right way? It looks like there's a roadblock up ahead. Yeah, it's the right way. I'll be I the have judge of that. Here. Come on, let's take a closer look. It's completely blocked by the mine card. What do we do? Can we blow it up? Do you know cramping and jumping? Easy. It belongs to the mining team. We can't just destroy it. We should try and fix it. Easier said than done. Do you know how? Yeah, of course. Every underworlder worth their salt knows how to fix a minecart. Let me see. Hmm. Even the pin connecting the body to the chassis is broken. Not to mention the rear wheel set bearing. This looks like the work of Svarog's minions. 
We need to find spare parts we can use nearby. <sighs> We're wasting time. Just blow it off then. Beep, beep, beep. Friends, do you need to find something? Mindy can help. How come you just jumped out on your own, little fella? Isn't your module thingy broken? Beep, beep, beep. My brainwave scanner module is indeed broken. However, manual input for search is still operable. Come on, input the name of the object you were looking for. Mindy can help. Oh, well, aren't you confident? Ah, let me give it a try then. Okay, what do you want? Where's the input interface? Ah, found it. Minecart pin, minecart wheel set. Confirm. Just like that? Beep, beep, beep. Request is being processed. Beep, beep, beep. Match successful. Initiating search for lost item. Minecart pin. Beep, beep, beep. Item found. Please commence search according to the home use object finder safety manual. Oh. Press R to use review direction of hiding item. Over there. Beep, beep. Uh huh. Show direction. Red indicate longer distance. Green indicate close distance. Beep. As stated in the terms of service, my search result accuracy and reliability are not guaranteed. For more information, please call inter- Beep, beep, beep. As stated in the terms of service, my search result accuracy and reliability are not guaranteed. For more information, please call in Beep, beep, beep. Inter-astral peace appliances. Okay, up there. Your most trustworthy companion. Astral Peace Appliances, your most trustworthy companion. Yeah, 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 yeah. Somewhere beep, here. Beep, beep, beep. Based on your search history, I recommend the Humanoid Tactical Microwave. Press skip to cancel personalized ads. Beep, beep, beep. Based on your search history, I recommend here. the Humanoid Tactical Microwave. I... Press skip to cancel personalized ads. Beep, beep, beep. Inter-Astral Peace Appliances, your most trustworthy companion. Hmm. Beep, beep, beep. Based on your search history, I recommend the Humanoid Tactical Microwave. Press skip to cancel personalized ads. Beep, beep, beep. As stated in the terms of service, my search result accuracy and reliability are not guaranteed. For more information, please call in beep, beep, beep. Inter-Astral huh? Peace Appliances, what? your most trustworthy companion. It says here, but... Beep, beep, beep. Is it bar? your search history, I recommend the Humanoid Tactical Microwave. Uh... Battle, Adventure... Home use. Ah, uh, produce. Find the short distance. Uh huh. By using intersection point where. Ah. Okay. Press skip to cancel personalized ads. Beep 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 beep. beep. Potential target object detected. The current search has concluded. Ah. Let me see. We just have to be uh, as near yeah. as possible. We can make do with this part. This little machine isn't half bad. Beep, beep, beep! What's that? Is that a hint of respect for Findy? How convenient! So, next time Don Hum gets lost, we can just use Findy to find him, right? Beep, beep. Beep. Biological life form search is currently not uh, supported. If you have any questions, what is done, please huh? call Inter Get lost Peace easily. Appliances. Well, it was a good idea. Let's look for the next part. Beep, beep, beep. Initiating search for lost item. Minecart wheel set. Beep, beep, beep. Item found. Please commence search. Okay. Now we can try again. 
Yeah, that's uh, a little bit too far. As stated in the terms of service, my search result accuracy and reliability beep 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 potential target object detected. The current search has Easy. been That's everything. You were a big help, Findy. Beep beep beep. It was nothing. Enter Astral Peace Appliances, your most trustworthy companion. Beep beep beep. Current search complete. <sighs> Entering sleep mode. Please Why is this Lobo so human-like? <laughs> We're pretty lucky, huh? Without Findy, it probably would have taken half the day to find these parts. Well, not that long. But that little machine definitely made it a lot easier. All right, let's go back and fix the minecart. Okay. Are you gonna do it yourself? Why wouldn't I? You've got to be self-reliant down here. Watch, you might learn something. Okay. Flipper, yes. So we fix together. All right, mission accomplished. <laughs> Quick work. You know, I didn't think you guys had worked a day in your lives. But you know how to get your hands dirty. The cart is about to depart. We oh. We the robots will have seized the road ahead by now. Whoa! Stop! Uh, stop! 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 There's a big evil hunk of metal right there. That model. It's one of Svarog's lapdogs, all right. Don't be afraid. I've dealt with those robots before. Let's go. All right. The truth of life and death, revealed in an instant. The sanctuary is but a vision. Break! Everything is ordained by those stars. Give these trailblazers your blessing. Lock on. Move carefully. Okay. Who will it be? Let's go. Ah, oh, we don't have enough. Ah, oh, they're gonna hurt. Who invited you? <laughs> Enemy targets detected. Ready for another? Ow, she almost dead now. Lock on. Okay. As a. Uh, oh no. Bad. Let's make it quick. Rules are made to be broken. Okay. Is this. Enemy data secure. Netmark is activated. Time for a good old counter attack. Too late to repent. The truth of life in this sanctuary. Is okay, 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 okay. Let's go. Nice. Oh, so close. Uh huh. Cute. Bye bye. The combat report will be ready soon. Uh, let's. Keep at it. Oh, we can't leave our ass stuff. Not bad. What over here? A chest. <laughs> All right, and nothing more. So let's continue. I've no interest in conflict. We have the upper hand. <laughs> let's make it quick. Huh? 
Okay, okay, okay. Is meaningless. Stop, stop. Ah, oh, you have heal now. Really? The truth of life and death revealed in an instant. The sanctuary is but a vision. Break! Enemy data secure. Net markers activated. Time for good old counter attack. Hello. Oh. Okay, then let's just keep this. Oh no! We are dead. Ready for another? Let's just spam Q. Okay. Damn, Barrier is strong. The combat report will be ready soon. Barrier block one instant of damage. Inventory that is really complete. good. Seeing it up close. This vein's even more spectacular. What over here? I doubt the underground will ever see it fully excavated. Mm. Ah, it's block, really. Where is our neck? Uh, what do you call again? This thing, the warp thing. Ah, it's over there. Really? Quiet. I've no interest in conflict. We have the upper hand. Ready for another? The truth of life and death revealed in an instant. Let's hear this guy. Is but a vision. Break. Commencing support. Enemy data secure. Net markers activated. Time for good old counter attack. Really? The tree. If you're gonna be like that. <laughs> Gonna retreat. We need healer. We don't have healer. Is it bad? Seeing it up close. Hmm. Can do this. Scared yet? Huh? Enemy targets detected. Ready for another? Let's make it quick. The truth of life and death Cute revealed in sanctuary is but a vision. Break. Oh, let's see. Commencing support. <laughs> Ow, that hurt. Enemy ready for another? Okay. Seeing it up close, this vein's even more spectacular. I doubt the underground will ever see it fully excavated. Mm -hmm. Asta, I think you need to change with Servo. Because there are a lot of enemy that weak to lightning. And we have to level up servo. Mm. Ah, where are you? Yes. Light cone equip. We have increased attack when used ultimate. Okay. Let's equip this and super impulse turn energy. That's good enough, right? And level it up. Yeah, that enough. Ah, wrong. 
collector servo level up yeah, let's use all that Alright, let's continue. Oh, the, the, the healing is just over here. Oh, come on. Are we done with the dungeon? I just shake my. So this is I just shake my team. Are we done with? already? Mr. Sparov, it's such a massive thing. I've never seen so much Geo Marrow before. Calculating. Based on the average rate of excavation, this vein is enough to supply Bellabog with 231 days of energy, with a margin of error of 7 days. So small, or he's slow, but... I sense that your reason for summoning me is not the aura in question. State your true intention, Clara. Right. I wanted Mr. Sparg to see that many miners and vagrants have gotten hurt because of the vein. Can you help them? I have already prevented the dispute and taken temporary control of the excavation zone. Evaluation result. In the event of no further variables, there will be no large-scale armed oh. conflict within the next 30 days. Well, that's how Lobot fixed the problem, right? I know why you did it, Mr. Sparog. It's just... I don't think it'll be enough. The mining team and Wildfire... They don't understand your actions. If only we could do more for them. My mission is the protection of the underworld. The trust of the minority sample is redundant to my calculations. Ah. Uh... Human behavior will always deviate from rational calculation, Clara. As evidenced by their presence here. Sparag! We haven't settled our final score. Zila, subordinate to Wildfire. Your resistance is futile. The result of my calculation is unequivocal. Remaining in the underworld is the optimal strategy for survival. Huh. This again. Calculation results, survival strategies. I haven't got time for your thesis. Withdraw your forces, or I'll lose my temper. Observe, Clara. Even under abject conditions, Humans are unable to avoid division and conflict. But Mr. Sparog... Human failure to accept the calculation result is a significant threat to the survival strategy of the underworld. Calculation uh... complete. Result unequivocal. I don't like this. When Armed suppression of wildfire is... and right. their allies I don't like is this. the optimal course of action. His robots doesn't seem too friendly. Robot is gonna take her away. We must leave, Clara. External variables have triggered a calculation reset. The furnace core hub requires protection. Please, Mills, don't hit them too hard. <sighs> I was getting bored of those minions. Time for a real fight. Come at me. You doesn't help at all. Enemy data secure. Netmark activated. Time for a good old counter. Move carefully. Really? I just use my AOE and you come here. The truth of life and death. The sanctuary is but a vision. Break! Ready for another? Pretty good crowd today. Turn it up! Let's make it quick. This is our chance. Okay, okay, okay. Shot again. Targets detected. Uh, we can remove. <laughs> ah, I pressed the wrong button. 
Keep up. Ready to lose yourself? Let's try this. You can fight it or rock with it. Hmm, that looks good. Yeah. Ow, that hurt. Ruins are made to be broken. Enemy data secured. Netmark activated. Time for good old counterattack. Fighting is meaningless. Ah, you reset that. The truth of life and death with the sanctuary is but a vision. Break! Commencing support. <gasps> this song's for you. Turn it up. Let's go. Uh, I'm not dead. Easy. Phew. Not bad. How many of these big guys is Sparog hiding? A lot, which is why Wildfire has never been able to take him down. Svarog's forces are too strong. We don't have enough firepower. That go. Who is she? Don't worry about her. That girl is best pals with Svarog. She's always following behind him. He wouldn't harm her. I guess I'm just used to seeing them together now, even if I don't understand it. Let's look for the chief. No need to look far. Ah, nice work, finally Zilla. here. We were attacked After we done with everything. Robots. Who knows where they came from? We thought we were in it for the long haul. <laughs> chief! Is everyone okay? Is anyone injured? We're fine. We're used to it at this point. Open we your sent mouth, those pesky robots and Open your mouth. troops packing. The mine. And uh, who are your friends here? Ah, them. They're outsiders that Sample brought down from who knows where. They need a favor from Wildfire, so I brought them with me. It'll be faster if they explain. <laughs> Are you a sheep? You are hard man to fight. <laughs> That's quite the tone to take on our first meeting. I won't forget you in a hurry. So, you went to all this trouble to find wildfire. What help is it you need? Okay. So we explain everything about Steranon. <laughs> I didn't know you'd put on a show for the overworld too. Impressive. <laughs> well, this is new. Wildfire can barely take care of the underworld. And now outsiders are looking for assistance from us. This Stellaron you speak of. Never heard of it. But if it's a secret that even we locals don't know about, then one name does come to mind. Uh, you mean... Sample? <laughs> really? Sampo? You might as well try the Supreme Guardian. The current Supreme Guardian is a liar who uses sweet words to deceive the underworld. She's never cared about our survival. Stop right there. I won't allow you to insult the Madam Guardian. In this overworld, my words may be painful to you, but every one of them is true. Go out into the towns and hear for yourself. See how the people here suffer. I haven't gotten close to voicing the extent of the underworld's grievances, young lady. But I will respect your request. I will leave it at that for now. Let's get back to the main topic. The name that came to my mind was Svarog. Huh? Isn't Svarog Wildfire's sworn enemy? Why would a mere robot in the underworld have knowledge of important secrets? Sworn enemy. <laughs> Not how I see it. The young master here is closer. Svarog is a cold and unfeeling machine. He recognizes only the dead reasoning of his calculations. Mm. Svarog is not against wildfire. Or perhaps I should say, wildfire isn't even of concern to him. That ancient robot witnessed the war. Oh, how old is, how old is he? If you're looking to pick up a thread, 
he may well be your best source. <laughs> Don't judge a book by its cover. I myself have put a few centuries behind me. Would you be able to tell? Well, your faith in the f eye, so that not the same thing. I'm familiar with over 20 long life species. None of them look like you. Uh, hey, would it kill you to play along? Robots don't forget. If Sparog hasn't heard of your Stellaron, then I'm afraid perhaps no one has. In which case, we need to think of a way to convince Svarog to communicate with us. Or get him to hand over his memory bank. <laughs> we could go through it ourselves. <sighs> what should we do? Go with Kara, I think. We've tried repeatedly to negotiate with Svarog, but he rejects every effort. He believes that wildfire is a threat. Still, if it were you guys, hmm, it's difficult to say. We have time. Let's get into the details tomorrow. It's late, and you must have been through a lot. Go back to the town and rest. I'll make arrangements. Okay. Again? I'm starting to get nervous of arranged rest on this planet. <laughs> As for our silver mane girl here, do you have time? I'd like to talk with you in private. What did we get? Faded sun. Go to the accommodation. Analyze the targets before you make a plan of action. Oh, no, 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 no. I just want to see what your uh, weakness is. Eyes. I thunder wind. Okay, that's good. Not good enough. We're not healing. We need healing. We need healing. Up here. Okay. And what over here? Those guys. Hmm. Okay, let's find the robot first. Hello. Come on, why do you need to be her? Commencing support. This song's for you. Enemy data secure. Netmarker activated. Time for a good old counter attack. Pretty good crowd today. Turn it up. Ready to lose yourself? Yep. You can fight it. Rock with it. Hmm. I hope this if you if you do this they're gonna kill too, right? Not enough uh, Okay. Ah oh, she can't stand that damage. I've no interest in combat. Truth of life and death. But the sanctuary is but a vision. Break. We not even make a den in his HP yet. Is it bad? <laughs> okay, good job. That target. This song's for you. Bad, bad, bad. Let's rock. This is our chance. Ready to lose yourself? You can fight it or rock with it. Rules are made to be broken. Let me retreat. Hmm. Let me let's change our team setup a bit. you to Marsh and let's level Marsh a bit Marsh Marsh Marsh
Okay. This might work or no, but let's try. We need some kind of healing or shielding. Analyze the target whatever. before you make a plan of action. Okay, it's freeze. Nice. Oh no. I have no interest in conflict. The truth of life and death. Reveal the sanctuary is but a vision. Break. Enemy targets detected. Ready for another? You can't run! Enemy data secured. We should Network do. Activated. Time for good old counter attack. My turn. Heal your <laughs> not heal. Heal <laughs> yourself. You're annoyed. Too late to repent. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Better. Fighting is meaningless. That before. Ready for another? Ow. Ooh. Ah, this is bad. <laughs> Here. Gotta try hard some. Watch this awesome move. This is bad, it's bad. Let's go. He's gonna die. No interest in conflict. Commencing the truth support. of life in the sanctuary is but a vision. Break. Enemy targets detected. That a lot of damage. <laughs> Our beating. Fighting is meaningless. Data secure. Network is activated. Okay, okay. We might be able to win this. Who? Okay. <gasps> Tough luck running into me. Let's shoot. Uh, this is our chance. I have no interest in conflict. Commencing support. Let's to beat it now. I just need to survive. This. Try that again. The truth of life in this sanctuary. Okay, 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 okay. Nice. Commencing support. Ready for another? Enemy data secure. Net markers activated. Time for good old counter attack. Let's go. 
Not yet. Die. Finally. Ooh. That really hard. Right. I know that we can come back later to fight him, but since we are here, why not do it right now? Right. Too late to repent. Okay. Enemy targets detected. <gasps> My turn. Let's make it quick. Easy. Ow, More interesting ow, ow. conflict. Web to oh, is that a lot of enemy. The truth of life and death revealed in sanctuary. He were at least one of them. Enemy targets detected. Told you this fight. Netmarker's back. Break everyone. Nice. Are made to be broken. All right. Again. Easy. Was I seeing things? No, you're not. Fighting is meaningless. Mm. Ready for another? Told you I could fight. <laughs> Here. I can't run. Bye. Oh, come on, really. Commencing support. Let's go. No interest in conflict. Any targets detected? Tough luck running into me. Okay. We have a big fight somewhere. This one. Let's look here first. Fragrant. Do we have treasure? No, maybe not. What was that? Why are your sense so good? There's no fragrant here, but there are treasures. Yes. Inventory nice. complete. How many? Three more. Let me check the level of the guy below. If we in a five level range, we can fight him. Four. That even better. Too late to repent. Mm. Enemy data secured. Netmarkers activated. Time for a good old counter attack. Let's do this first. Lidio defense. Right. We have the, the truth of life and death. But the sanctuary is but a vision. Break. We have the upper hand. Ready for another? Rules are made to be broken. Come on. Watch this awesome move. That hurt. Oi. Really? Told you 
told you I could fight. Let's make it quick. Ow. Let's go. No oh, I didn't. Uh, I didn't know that he's the second one. The truth of life and death revealed in an instant. The sanctuary is but a vision. Break. We have the upper hand. Uh. Ready for another? Uh. Enemy data secure. Net markers activated. Time for a good old counterattack. Ow. Uh. Uh. Just a scratch. Retreat. This is not gonna work out. Okay. Let's go to where we have to go then. We've been doing this for too long now. Let's progress with our story. Right. Do you need me to formulate the next plan? Oh, you must be Oleg's guests. Welcome to the Gerda Grand Hotel. Mm-hmm. Grand uh, Hotel. Hey, that's not very polite. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine. You weren't the first guest to have that reaction. A few hundred years ago, one ancestor of the Gerda family was ambitious and sought to build something big from nothing. Eventually, he actually did it. Uh, have you seen that stylish Goethe Hotel? Strictly speaking, it's a branch of this grand hotel. Oh, people with big dreams have big determination. Mm. Oleg wants me to take good care of y'all. Here's the key. You'll be staying in our most spacious guest room. Okay. What do you think? Should we go ahead and call it a day? Or Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm tired, let's go back and rest. Uh, time let's progress to rest with again. the story. I hope there aren't any surprises this time. That Oleg, he seems sincere. What do you guys think? Uh, I think he's a good person. Mm. Uh, don't you have something cool to say? Like, appearances can be deceiving? <laughs> I don't try to disagree. But if you ask for my opinion, it's better to be safe than sorry. Ah, oh, fine. We'll keep our guards up. Our last hotel experience was eventful, to say the least. One of us should keep watch tonight. Uh, keep watch? Are we space cowboys now? Huh? I guess this is the cosmic wild west. <laughs> uh, anyone else sleepy? I am. <laughs> Mars look the most awake. Uh, no, I don't. <laughs> uh, besides, I've never pulled an all-nighter before. Do you know how bad it is for your skin? I'll keep watch. Oh. Branya, did you finish talking to Oleg? Hope he didn't make things difficult for you. Not really. Though it wasn't the friendliest conversation. We didn't see eye to eye on everything. I've come to know a great deal in a short time. Doubt I'll be able to fall asleep tonight. I doubt I'll be able to sleep either. Not that I don't trust you. <laughs> it's just you're a silver main guard officer in the underground. There might be people looking to harm you. I wouldn't be surprised if there are. The silver main guards have a lot to make amends for down here. If someone had made a stand in the outset and explained the consequences to Madame Kokolia, forget it. It's meaningless to talk about it now. You don't need to worry about me. Oleg guaranteed that I wouldn't be harmed. He seemed like a man of his word. Go and rest. Thank you. Thank you for keeping watch. Sleep. I lost her. My wish. Your so-called plan. What is the point of it all? Oh, the queen go mad. Silence! She is my daughter. My 
only you soulless thing how could you begin to fathom you will never understand never <sighs> Is it bad? Okay. That, and that voice again. Oh, is that a dream? Such that we a see? strange dream. May as well go for a walk if I can't sleep. Okay. Who goes there? Show yourself! I am here. I'm Carlos. <laughs> oh, it's you. Don't sneak up behind me next time. Lucky for you, I wasn't armed. <laughs> no sleep for you either, huh? <laughs> I can't sleep it. I worry about the future. I know what you mean. I don't like the feeling that I'm not in control. And now, actually, seeing as there's no one around, it, can I ask you some things? This Stellaron you speak of, if you were to find it, how sure are you that you could stop the Eternal Freeze? Uh, you better add Don Ha for that. Is he your leader? I feel he possesses a great stillness of mind in everything he does. You know, it was difficult for me to believe you. Some of the words you use are too alien for those that have lived their entire life in Bellabog. As far as I was concerned, Madame Kakolia's order to arrest you sounded reasonable. But why didn't she issue it straight away? She must have realized something about you. Something I haven't yet been able to perceive for myself. It bothers me. What must have transpired to cause her such a drastic change? Uh, still, orders are orders. It's not for soldiers to question their superiors. You are the princess, you're not a soldier, right? Well... Hmm... Ah. I don't need you to remind me. And I didn't have every confidence that I was doing the right thing. But... The sense of duty to carry out an order is bound to prevail with me. Huh. In the past, overworld soldiers on the front line would lose their lives in droves. And yet, the Fragmentum's advance would remain unaffected. Nevertheless, that was her reason for deploying all the Silvermane guards to the front line. The transport line for supplies in Geomero remained open. But the passage between the surface and the underground ceased. Huh. I approved of that decision. I never thought that the underworld would sink into such ruin without the Silverman guards. Perhaps Mother was wrong. But how can I change her mind? I've tried, but she won't listen. I don't know how to get through to her. We will help. Help me change the mind of the Madam Guardian? <laughs> Not easy. But he knows that better than I do. Oh, you can become Madame Guardian. Uh, the more I think about it, the more disoriented I get. Which in turn makes me think about it even more. I just want a better life for the people of Bellabog. Uh, you can't save the world alone. You know that, right? Maybe you're right. Or not. Right now, I... I just need more time to think. Walk with me. Let's forget our problems for a while. Okay. You're on a date! <laughs> mm. I can't remember the last time I went for a walk like this. I never thought I'd take one through such a strange place. 
with someone I'd only just gotten to know. It's so quiet here. I'm not used to it. Ah, uh, the quieter things are around you, the louder they- I'm surprised the vagrants in the Great Mine go after the mining teams. They must be desperate. Where are we Still, going? Whatever their situation, a crime is a crime. How is the law supposed to find a balance between justice and compassion in the face of such complexity? How much longer can you last with your current supplies? Is that Zila? Let's go take a look. I know. But you have a whisper. I'll go to Rivet Town and bring them back for you. It's too dangerous to go alone. Get Oleg to send someone with you. The rest of Wildfire has barely gotten any sleep the last few days. They should rest. They'd only be holding their eyelids open and slowing me down. Besides, didn't you say some of the miners were gravely injured? Lives are on the line. Hello. <laughs> it sounds like we are left just on time. Aren't you supposed to be sleeping? What are you doing out here? Walking. Up to no good, perhaps? We're just having a walk neither of us could sleep. You can rescind your baseless accusations. <laughs> walk somewhere else, then. Easy, Zila. Maybe they can help. Yeah, are we willing to help me? It's not a shot. I'm grateful. Here's the situation. The clinic is packed full of people injured in the mines incident. Since you helped us resolve things, Zila and I have been busy caring for them. As you know, the underground is lacking resources to begin with. Add on the sudden nature of the incident, and it's no surprise that the clinic is almost out of medical supplies. We need to acquire more. Somehow. Uh... Get sample to get some. You don't know him at all yet, do you? You can't rely on people like Sampo when it's important. As the fragmentum spreads underground, more monsters go roaming around, causing trouble for all the towns. That means more vagrants in the mines. The town's resources have been swallowed up by the fragmentum. To get anything now, people have to risk their lives. Easy now, Zila. Anchor isn't good for one's health. <laughs> Zila and I actually aren't from here. We both come from an industrial town to the north. A few years ago, the fragmentum began to seep into the town center. I used to manage an orphanage and clinic there. But after the fragmentum corroded the area, I had no choice but to move here to Boulder Town. After all, I have to survive myself if I want to save more people. Go to a corroded town to collect some useful resources? I'm in. Alright, what's the plan then? You want to come as well? But you look quite tired. Hold up! I never said you could join us! People's lives are at stake. Why wouldn't you want another person to help? Besides, I have some experience with the Fragmentums. I'm sure I will Maybe be just of not. use. <laughs> well, just don't slow me down. Zila's lack of outright rejection means she approves of you. <laughs> With you all accompanying her, my mind will be more at ease. Come, let me give you a list of materials we need. Okay. The place you're going to is called Rivet Town. Follow the path through the mountains to the north for a bit, and you'll arrive there. <sighs> let me think. Uh, I'm almost out of metal plates and bandages used for immobilizing broken bones. There's a market in the center of Rivet Town. Residents left behind piles of materials there when they evacuated. Please look for some there. Okay. Oh, also rubbing alcohol. I kept a bunch at the orphanage, since the kids often got into tussles. <laughs> I didn't bring it with me when I left. Oh, I hope it's still intact. Lastly, painkillers. There should be a bunch stored in the old lab. Hopefully they haven't been destroyed by monsters. These should be enough to get by for a bit longer. Be careful. Don't push yourselves too hard. Can I get these two in my team to Metal help? Metal plates and bandages, rubbing alcohol, and painkillers. Got it. 
piece of cake. Let's go. If we leave now, we can still make it back before sundown. When it comes to helping injured people groaning in pain, the sooner the better. If we hadn't happened to be passing by, were you really planning on going into the Fragmentum alone? Of course. What's all the... F One moment. AdSense. Oh, we unlocked AdSense. Nice. Yay, let us send everyone. Let's send. Uh, I used you, so let's do this. Also you. Nice. Fuss about. I've done that loads of times. So reckless. According to the rules of the Silver Main Go Lilac. Ah. Oh. Good. Now we can. Okay, we're gonna end the stream after I get to 5 star. <laughs> we're not gonna continue anymore. That's enough. Nice, nice. A lot of star real pass. Nice. Guards, any expedition into the Fragmentum must have a squad of at least four members, as well as a communications officer. Exactly. A rule of the Silvermane Guards. Don't apply your rules to us. We have plenty of time. Alright, that is where we need to go. So, let's do this. Let's do this. Alright. So we gonna get one from this seven, right? I don't have any preference. Give me anyone you want to give me game. Please! Gordon! Oh, so this is how the animation for 5 star look like. Okay. Now who is gonna be? Ah, we got full star life cone. Nice. Who? Bronya. Is she good? I don't know. <laughs> anyway. Yes. Okay, we get Bronya. That good, right? What did you do? Let's see. Base attack. Oh, you use a gun. Support. Dispel debuff from single ally allow them to take action. Increase their damage. Oh, that's really good. That's really good. When the skill is used on Bronya herself, she cannot immediately take action again. Ah, okay. Oh, ultimate it increased attack of all ally. Increase crit damage equal to <laughs> for two turn technique at the start of the next battle. All ally can ah so you are the buffer after using normal attack. Attack will be at one. Oh, I see, I see. With other on, I don't think I can unlock any of this. This is my luck. I don't think I'm gonna get any <laughs> any more five star in this game. So we need three hundred more to who try to who for Sela. It will be hilarious to have Sela and Bronya in the same team, right? <laughs> but that is good enough. I re I really glad to get Bronya. And get level five. <sighs> oh, we can do one more walk. Let's do that. This one, yeah. 
Okay, one more five star, please. <laughs> anyway, let's see. Ah, only four star. Okay. Anyone? Anyone? Any new collector? I want some new collector. Oh, it's is it the one from the event? I see. Is that the only one we think? Ah, uh, we only get life coin. Okay, that's fine. That is enough for today. Thank you everyone for watching this episode with me and having fun together. <laughs> we progress quite a bit in our story and unlock the ascension. And finally got my own 5 star unit which is Bronya. I'm gonna go level her up and might look online how to build her. <laughs> For now, that is enough for today. I gotta go. I hope you have a good day and bye bye. Oh, I forgot. If you like what you've seen so far, don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel and maybe follow me on Twitch too if you want. Alright, bye.